Bienvenidos, welcome everyone to another video and this is going to be the introduction to my world or to my channel or to whatever this is. Yeah, I'm going to show off my builds in my Minecraft world. This is a survival world and this is, has uh, already progressed in it and uh, I've already gotten diamond boots, diamond armor and everything, even a trident and uh, wings and uh, everything so let's get to it let's let's see uh, where I decided to make my base so this right here is my my whole base and uh, there's a top part which is the, the the little village on top you know with all the nice decorative things and still needs more work on it and then it's the bottom part which is down there and uh, from here you can't see that well hey turtle how you doing turtle but down there it's all glass and you can see down to the to my base that was the idea of it it was like a floating piece of rock here and in the bottom it's all glass that's what my uh my idea was so that from the bottom i can see up into the sky and enjoy the stars but here we go this is the path where you come in from our spawning area which is all the way around all the way over there so i made a trail a nice trail where you can come in your horse this is going to be the entrance so you have your portal in the center and the bottom of the portal uh, is your little cave where there this was a river so all this i uh, flatten it out and made this like an underground uh layer type thing where i can come in my boat and you know just come in here uh where the phantoms won't kill me and just come out on top of here this is all the beachy side and we haven't done anything over here and then over here is the entrance of the river and then over there we got that uh iron farm and these are the huts that we made just so we can have something of a village type there you go, nice interior, nice open up layout. We're gonna put some villagers there and there, and we gotta watch out for the for those uh phantoms. I think I heard them. So yes, these are the, the huts that we made. Here is our map area where we have our maps. This is the world map on this side, and then over here we have our treasure maps. The ones that you have don't see discovered. Those are not. Uh, discovered yet on this side we have no what is the base map which is uh, where our base is and that's where we are right now and that's the little decorative uh, you know trees and houses and little small village that we're doing we're still gonna progress on this area on top you can't see much of the bottom one the bottom base but the bottom base is basically all of this all up to here and like all that around we're still making it bigger as we speak here is our chest where we have a, a, a free map for our other maps where we are going to put and let's start going uh let's start going under un, un, underground before these phantoms come at me look at them look at them they really want to get me they want to get me up there you won't get me all right let's go underground down this way we have come down the stairs and now we are it is time to show our base so this is the whole base uh the main part of the base uh our smell our uh, our item sorter you can tell you can see there i got all the main uh construction or building blocks you know dirt underside gravel you know all the, the essentials and on that side i have all the food and all the other miscellaneous items over here we have our skeleton spawner the first one we found in the world and that's how everything began just you know carving little by little around it and spending my most of my time here and then from there it just evolved uh, downward and and all that stuff so uh, I'll explain that uh, in another video maybe just how I started this base and uh, how we ended up in how we ended up here that right there is a clearly an iron farm which does not work in this new update in aquatic 
for some reason so I need to fix that uh, but we have a lot of iron so it's all good and uh, down there is our, our villagers so let me just walk down here hopefully it doesn't glitch too bad but uh, I'll just stare down for a little bit and I'll just show you around boom shulker boxes so this is everything that I have in my shulker box we got fire rockets we got a bunch of other stuff we got our our redstone uh, shulkers right there why are you pausing and we got more stuff we got wood we got our our armors and our, our stuff we got our enchantment stuff we got things that we found in our in the in the end our end shulker we got our diamond emerald iron all the ones in the bottom are all our ores and stuff our redstone and our coals and our and our uh, 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 what's this uh, uh, dried kelp and these are all of our elytras that we have found so like I said we have been playing for a bit here this isn't a new world this is already a played world over here we have our farms where we farm up you know variety uh, all of our uh, things so we don't when we are here we don't have to go nowhere and then they're dispensed and they're picked up by hoppers and transferred into our sorting system so everything here is connected to the sorting system now coming from the farms over here we have another farm which is the sugarcane farm it's something small I don't need too much sugar cane, I just need sugar and a little bit of paper, not too much. And to behind this is the iron uh, farm, of course. We'll stop moving, please. There's the iron farm, and over here is our super smelter. In the bottom, you can see is all the redstone and all this, all this, uh, all the furnaces ready to get loaded. Here is our where you put in what you want to cook up. And over here is where you want to put uh, thing like you know lava or anything to cook it with. You know, uh, here is our, our off switches. Is uh, it, towards us means off, which is nothing's gonna go and filter down and uh, you know get cooked up yet. So you can fill all these up first and then let it sort it out, right? And up here, in both sides, we have. Uh, shulker uh, box you know so you can load it up with the shulker box it's uh, compatible with that and yeah so you can bring in all of our goodies and cook it up real quick uh, next to that is our uh, melon and pumpkin farm that we have here it's a really simple design really efficient and really whoa, 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 whoa. So, like I was saying before that creeper interrupted, this is a very efficient farm and this is only one tier that I have and it's producing so much uh, product and so much uh, thing, uh, pumpkin and melons uh, to trade. That's what I've been using it for. Down there's uh, the cart, the pickup cart with the hopper. And over here is our meat department where we get our meat from and it's a simple design i don't remember who i got it from but uh i saw it on the internet on youtube you can just you know look for for uh um, you know uh ooh, a cow farm uh cooker and i think it's a cooker and uh or was a cooker this was supposed to be lava it was supposed to be lava up here but what i did was i just switched it for bone arrows so I cook my own because uh, I, I was I was losing I was losing product I was losing product so I was I was like I'd rather cook it myself in my smelter and that's that's that for the farms I think <clears throat> I don't have too many farms just a few and uh, let's show the villagers now so our villagers are have been the ones that have been saving us from 
you know, having good enchantments and good tools and stuff like that. So all these guys are have been with me from the beginning. I kind of make made this corridor, and from here we started expanding all around. <clears throat> so these guys were here from the get go, and they've seen everything. Uh, up there we have a mending villager right there in that little um, what is that? Uh, I keep forgetting granite blocks right there. This is, uh, that's our number one villager. Uh, he needs more love. They all need more love. So yeah, we're gonna make a bigger space over there. And I'm already transporting them in uh, minecarts, as you can see. And we are. Sorry, I just paused the video. Uh, I apologize. <laughs> and yeah, so we're gonna move all the villagers to the back of uh, our base, uh, just so they can be closer to. Um, the main uh, island so I can transfer transport them to the top more easy easily so this is gonna be our breeder our villager breeder I'm still working on it I, something happened that I broke some blocks and they are almost got out uh, that's why you see them in a hole <laughs> I was just like just in case they walk out I can uh, easily fix it so yeah those are our villagers right there <coughs> Over here, we have what is the beginning of a massive aquarium. So right here, we had a bunch of uh, buckets of fish, and uh, it was causing lag in my chest. So I put them up as uh, for display, so I can see which ones I have and which ones I don't have, and uh, try to get them all, catch them all, like the Pokemon. So in Minecraft. This is what I'm going to So collect. that is what we are collecting in Minecraft. This is going to be our pastime, our hobby of collecting things here. And in real life, we, we actually collect, we are also collectors. We collect diecast cars and baseball, basketball, and football cards. And uh, yeah, so we're going to keep the collection going. And that that, that is it from me up here. Now let's we, we need to go downstairs to the basement to see what is going on down there coming straight down here and through our stairs we can see the rest of our sorting system and uh, we still need uh, to fill out all the other hoppers this is our old uh, way of uh, holding things and our older layout and this is going to be our newer layout where uh, how we're going to set it up now <coughs> Uh, as you can see like that and then over there are the farms and the hoppers go all the way through there and then they line up here into these this elevator into these uh, d droppers they go up uh, as an elevator this is an item elevator and this is a hopper chain so we have our skeleton spawner connected we have our sugar cane connected our iron we have not connected that because I've been wanting to manually collect and to see how much that's been working. Our super smelter and our sorter back. So we get so many drops here. Bows, bow and arrows, bones, and armor from all types of armor. And we need to we need to find a way to you know sort it all and uh, send it, uh, arrange it. So this is what we have here. We have an item sorter for only two items: bows, uh, sorry, um, bow and arrows. And bones these get transported away in and in, into our item sorter while the bow the bows and all the armor get transported through all these hoppers into our sorter over here and this is where we manually um, take out all the items that cannot be smelted or cannot be used as a as a you know um, you know like these can be used to smell things some bones come in and uh, we have to we have to clean all that up so we have all this to fill out and once this fills up that light turns on we clean out all the armor that cannot go through this the smelter as fuel and um, and yeah I uh, dispose of that any gold and iron armor get uh, thrown into the smelter to get smelted into pieces and the uh, and the bows go in as fuel so that's what happens here and uh, this this machine over here and uh, let's turn it on 
and everything can get transported over there into the smelter. Here is the melon and pumpkin farm uh, hopper chain. Producing so much lag that I had to turn them off for a little bit, just for right now, um, while I work on a little bit of more things. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much the whole base from the bottom, from the basement. Uh, let's just go over here and show you the AFK area. This this area has been the first one of this base that I think that I have made. So like right, right here, this has been this, the the platform. Uh, it has changed, but this right here has been the same spot that I've uh, AFK'd this whole time. And from here, <clears throat> it all started. So how I got into this, uh, eventually how I got into this farm here, into the XP farm, at the beginning was from in the water. So I had to, you know, swim down and uh, and, and find the, from all the gravel, just find my door and uh, my little hole and come down. And then from right here, I just AK on this torch right here so that nothing can spawn. I put these here, these blocks, just for protection, for proc, um, just in case, you know, phantoms. When the when they updated the game, I put these there so that in case a phantom spawned inside, I wouldn't be, you know, uh, hit or killed. <clears throat> so from here. Uh, this rails are temporary I just use them to load the whole system over there the item sorter because only half of it gets gets loaded while I'm here just standing here and uh, this is where the rails here so I can go back and forth and that would be it that would be all my base here in this world the survival world that I have I hope you guys enjoyed it I hope you guys tune in to another date uh, in the next video I will show the spawn area that is behind me towards that direction that is a whole different area and has more built so that's in a collaboration with me and my uh, nephews hopefully um, they can come more often so that I so that we can work on more builds but yeah I'm gonna leave that uh there for this episode i hope you guys enjoyed i hope you guys learn a little bit about who i am and uh my minecraft world and future things that we are going to build here so thank you very much have a good day hasta luego hasta la otra bye